Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to talk about skincare that I recommend. Um, and this is the skincare that I usually do in a daily basis. Alright, so I got no makeup on today because I'm too lazy. As per normal. I just got my glasses on and this lip gloss. I Just a quick um, story about the lip gloss. Basically, the top of the lip gloss cap lost and they only left the you know white inside here the white I don't know what is it called so I wanted to glue the top cap to the uh, white thing inside that holds the stick of the gloss and I lost the cap and this is what I do I put it with <laughs> tissue so this is the very first lip gloss that um that I bought I, I bought this is the new one, so I'm using the new one. This is for home and this is for outside. So some of the, see some of the super glue is not dry yet and I touched it. So I'm going to let it dry. So the skincare routine that I'm going to do, I mean not, not skincare routine, I'm sorry. Skincare that I recommended. Alright, so for those of you, you people that have, um that have sensitive skin oops that has airplanes yeah that have sensitive skin um so i'm gonna recommend this because i use them so as i do in my previous video i use qv lotion uh, skin lotion repair skin and i also have the gentle wash for qv so use the gentle wash every time when you're in shower or if you do not like qv we have cetaphil and i also have cetaphil moisturizer but i do not like the cetaphil moisturizer yeah but i haven't tried this yet so i might want to try the cleanser but not use the moisturizer because i do not like how it sits on my face but it's fragrance free how about this yeah so this is perfume free basically fragrance free so yes so this is this is a good option for sensitive skin for me personally that i like the most um but for other people that really have sensitive skin you can go to like a website um there's one of this website i watch one of the youtuber there there's a customized um skin cleanser and moisturizer that you can do so that is perfect for oily or normal skin dry skin right so as well as i had for me i have acne prone skin because my acne is mostly oily so is it raining no it's not all right and i have this i do not know why i have two of these um, this is the uh, what is it called Ag oily and acne prone skin so this one is ultra cooling so this is um i did use it just now i washed with this just now and it's really good though and this is for like acne prone skin like for me because i just got one really the aeroplane is here I got one as you guys can see there's a little bump up there the acne is kind kind of like forming right there so use this um cleanser or yep ultimate cleanser and then use this cream what what what, what cream is this or uh, acne pimple medic medication so this one uh it says shake well shake well and then put it on my face for me i put it at my entire face because at my entire face anything would happen you know acne would come out anywhere so i put it at entire face and it absorbs really good i didn't expect it to absorb really good in my skin so there was a good um type of acne products but i really need to start using using this regularly i just started using it just now so I'm gonna see how it goes every day with this all right and I'm also gonna try this later on I'm gonna do I'm gonna take a bath in the 
afternoon because I already did in the morning. So I'm gonna take an afternoon bath and try to use this cleanser. But I think I'm gonna use the QV first, and then maybe tomorrow I'm gonna try the set of your cleanser. So this is a good option for acne, okay? But what I could say is you use it every single day. Wash your face every single day. This cream need to apply once a day or twice a day. Depends on how your skin is or how your acne uh, reacts to your skin. So this, yeah, probably this every day you need to wash your face with it. This every single day. Three more, which is one is Neutrogena Lab Hydrating Micellar Gel Cleanser for dry and reactivate reactive skin yes. I do not have a dry skin but at times in the cold weather I do have dry skin but I'm not sure of trying this but it could work you know to hydrate you know at least hydrate your skin even though your skin is oily alright and then next one is use one today okay this is night uh, what is this called ultra white spotless for nighttime what is this brand called use userine yes userine brand i think this is dermatologic der, dermatologic dermatological skincare yes and uh this usually i think yeah it's just a cream so you just apply this on your face and then avoid eye contact all right and this is good for every night so this is a good one i tried using this before it's very good though it it help your skin really you know smooth out your face so there's no texture and all all right so this is la roche posay brand and all here is words that i can't read but from what I know, this is a purifying foaming gel for oily sensitive skin. And tested on oily acne prone skin. And see how much I've used this. It's like here. It's like almost a full bottle, you know. So yes, um, this is used every day. Every day usage. So this must use every single time. Because I got this for a sample, so I've used quite some a lot. Yeah, I'm going to try to use all of this. So, uh, this QV skin lotion I'm going to put here. The Cetaphil lotion put there. And the cleanser I'm going to put inside this bin. So, that is the recommended products for me. And I usually... Um, I also recommend this clean and clear toner i've been talking about this every single time this is for oily person work deep in pores to oil control so this is for oily person like me okay every time before makeup after i wake up have a um after i had a bath you know everything is clean i use this every time before i went to bed i use this so this is the best product that i like because i'm an oily person i do not like moisturizer that much but for the qv lotion that absorbs really good in the skin it doesn't leave like a very oily feeling or very i don't know it's just a feeling that you know that the uh, the product is not absorbed properly so this is one of the items that i do not like which is nivea cream i've not used this at all look at this i didn't even touch it at all you know i was like uh should i even use this you know because i actually tried to use it once um but that's the previous can oh look <laughs> It's oily at the side. So that's the reason why I do not like this. This has oil in it. And my face is oily enough already. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna use this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. No. No way I'm not gonna use this. I think this is very suitable for very dry skin. So I think I'm gonna give this away to one of the app or someone that I could give away to so I'm gonna give this away I'm not gonna keep things that I do not use at all okay 
So, and also the second product is Acne Clear Skin a Pimple Treatment Non-Oily Skin Color Formula Dries up pimple, kill acne bacteria, and block oily pores So, I really do recommend this is really dang good for your acne And if you have oily skin like me, it's really good though So yes, that's the product that I really recommend people Alright, so that's the recommendation for me and um, if any of this helps or works for you, do leave it in the comments and yes, um, I'm going to end this video now because your girl is getting a little busy today. So I'm going to see you guys next time in my next video. Bye!